I'm Michelle from Storytime with Michelle, and this is Gia and Bianca. <laughs> and we are having so much fun exploring the world with our Global Kids Activity Deck published by Barefoot Books. Today we have selected the Flag Ceremony Card. Have you ever been to a flag ceremony before? No, I don't think no. so. Do you know what one is? Uh, I think so. Well, usually opening ceremonies for big sporting events. Like, like the World Cup? Like the World Cup or the World Indigenous Games or even the Olympics. That's when we will see a flag ceremony. And when we watch these ceremonies, it's really fun because you see the excitement, you see team pride, we'll watch the teams parading around, waving the flags that represent where they're from, and it kind of just creates a feeling of happiness and pride for everybody. So how about if we have a flag ceremony of our very own? Would you like that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I think we kind of have to decide what we're going to celebrate. It could be anything from a sporting competition or maybe a holiday. What do you think? Maybe summer. Because we're in the middle of it. That's a great idea, summer. Yeah. Should we do a, a flag ceremony for our love of summer? Mm-hmm. Okay, sounds like a good idea. Now, to get started, you'll need to gather just a few supplies. To make your own flag, you'll need some paper, tape, or glue. You'll need some sticks or straws that you can use as a flag pole, and some colored pencils. Or, that we can color it. That's right, or markers or paint, or whatever you like to decorate with. Our first step is to decorate our flag. So let's think about what kind of design we want to create on our pieces of paper. You know, you can make a flag from the country that you're from, that you live in now, or maybe the country that you were born in if you were born somewhere else, or maybe the country that you have relatives that live in, or you could maybe make a design similar to a sports team that you like, or you can just come up with your own flag using your own symbols that represent things that you care about. So let's get started. Okay. What does summer mean to you? What do you Fun. Like? Fun. Going to the beach a lot. Yeah. Flowers. Ooh, lots of pretty flowers. And how about all of those birds chirping? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Baby birds. Baby birds being born. Mm -hmm. I always think of sunshine. And I always think of the beach too. If you did want to copy a flag, you could always go through the deck of cards in your Global Kids deck because each of the cards have a flag that you can use as inspiration at the top. Hmm. So if you're curious about what a flag looked like, you can just flip through your deck. Well, it looks like we've all made our summer themed flags for our flag ceremony. And next, all we have to do is attach our flag to our flagpole. And you can use glue or tape. I've got some tape here. Yeah. Why not tape it to the back so we can really see how pretty your design came out. Take a piece of tape, put it to the back of your flag, and voila, just tape it right on. Okay, I think I'm done. Nice job. Well, our last step is to have our flag ceremony. Now, we could march around the house, we could play music or a favorite song, we could even do a dance, whatever you like. But remember, the most important thing at a flag ceremony is to wave our flags. So, uh, shall we go outside and give it a try and have our own flag ceremony? Sure, okay. All right. Thank you so much for joining us and I hope you'll create your very own flag and have your own flag ceremony. Until next time. Bye. Bye.